Think about this, right? You're in a limo with all your friends, even the ones you don't like. But imagine being stuck down there with them while they panicking. Which one you do? Knock them out? Or let them scream like a little bitch? Think about that. Submerged. I like this movie because this movie was straight to the point. It didn't, it didn't try to get too deep into the, like, too complicated where you have to figure stuff out. But the movie was awesome. The movie starts off very tense with the car, with the uh, limousine going straight into the water because it didn't show in the beginning how it went to the water, but it does get to that point. But the limousine goes into the water. The friends is in the back. The girl in the front, and, and she's next to the guy named Matt. And you might remember Matt because Matt is very rememberable because it reminded me of myself a little bit. And the movie starts off with this young lady's father that worked for this company, and a lot of people worked for this guy in this company, and he had to fire some people, because you know how corporate is. You know, they got to fire people, they got to let people go. And that got a lot of people riled up. That really rubbed off on them the wrong way. So, people put some things together to try to pull some shit out, some shit behind some shit, and know somebody that robbed somebody, that killed somebody, and they come after this, after the, this girl's father's daughter. Well, what the hell I'm talking about? At the father, they come after the father's daughter. So they end up being chased down. They're at the club. Some things going on. I'm sorry because I'm jumping. It's, it's, I'm, I'm trying to really shorten this down so y'all can definitely understand what this movie is about. Um, they're in the club. Things get heated. They get into a fight with a couple of guys. Next thing you know, they're being chased up the up the highway. Things start. The other guy act like he got to like throw up and shit so he gets out the car. So it's like he's trying to buy time. For other people to show up. Because it just seemed ironic. But I caught on to it. Mainly my wife caught on to it. I, I didn't know. I didn't know for sure. Because it was too many suspicious ass characters. But to make a long story short. Assholes show up. They chasing them down. They shooting at them. Shoot the tie out. Matt loses the fucking control of the car. It goes into the water. And now we got a shit show fest. 5,000 going on inside of the limousine. I can't stand it. When people panic really bad. It's like, how can you really focus on what's going on if you're panicking like shit down under the water? And I'm not understanding. It could be a frightening thing to be deep underwater and locked inside of a fucking limo. But I mean, this is use your brain. But I swear, like, if, if I had a part that er and aggravate the shit out of me, that part definitely did it. Because I feel like I was there. I was telling them, shut the fuck up. I was like, could y'all please shut the fuck up? Like, they could really hear me. But me and my passionaries, I'm so passionate when I watch movies because I really get caught up in moments like that. But before I say anything else, Let's give this movie a rating, shall we? I give this movie a thumb up and a smiley face. Ding. And you know what? Always like, the thing that tripped me up about this movie is that how crazy it could be when you, as a boss, you know, you're a boss and you fire a lot of people. And I don't know why people don't think that shit's gonna happen after people lose their job. You know, everybody got to live. But man, these people done had it, and they literally came after his daughter. And when I say they was well equipped. Shit, they had guns with lasers on it. If the motherfuckers was under the water, they had tanks, fucking swim gear, and harpoons. They was not playing. But to make a long story short, I like the dude Matt. The dude Matt is the shit because when the girl, they when they when they try to get out, they they you know took one person out, which is the black man always die. It doesn't matter if we in a thriller, a drama, a horror movie. We going down. So ain't no if ands and questions about that shit. I know if I played in something, they'd be like, hey, Mr. CML, uh, we let you play in this movie. Okay, sure. But uh, we want you to die. That's fucked up. I mean, but you know, let me make a long story short. I like this movie. Check it out. I didn't want to spoil it because everything that I was going into, y'all noticed that I was breaking. But if you ask me what 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 I said earlier, what I said. Personal? If, if, <laughs> <laughs> just don't ask me okay don't forget to hit the like button don't forget to hit that subscribe button and don't forget to leave a comment let me know what you think about submerged because i told you what i thought about it i thought it was awesome i thought it was okay and to all my movie lovers i love you <laughs>